Hello, Deb. Hello, you. <laughs> you right? Yep. Yeah. What are you doing? Checking like, back these trees because after you cut them all down, they're beginning to throw little spindly bits. Yeah. That's what I'm doing. Oh, I see you got some help. Yeah, of course. Mm. Ted ain't very far behind when I'm on that, is he? <laughs> Playing with his stick. Yeah. Do you want to have a look around the garden then? Because I think it's looking quite nice. Can do. Yeah? Mm -hmm. well, Shall we start in the garden instead of on the patio? We start, always start on the patio. Start where you want. Start where I was. Excuse that then. Right. <laughs> that will be cleaned up very soon. So, I've got a couple of new additions in this bed. I found some coleus this morning. <laughs> we love our coleus, don't we? It is quite a pretty plant and it is a good show, especially when this variety, yeah, yeah. when you've got the uh, the reds and the greens all mixed together. Yeah. Yeah, nice looking plants. They're lovely, I mean they need to grow a bit yet, they do go wild, don't they? And this Toysia has never flowered and I was beginning to think it was in the wrong spot. But look! One flower! <laughs> <laughs> I can't find any more, but I've got one flower. Yeah, quite pleased with that. So the hibiscus is doing quite well. That won't flower until late on. It's beginning to set bugs, I think. Yeah. I've stuck a clematis at the back there, and I, can, I keep ignoring it, but it needs winding on the tree. So I'll have to get back down there. This is in the foot, this area. Pretty. Oh, I can see some red. What's this? Can't remember. Goes wild in the Mediterranean, doesn't it? That's Oleander. It. Ah. Oleander, there you, you go. You remembered. I did remember. <laughs> I won't remember all the pants, you know what I'm like. See that little orange thing there? Zooming in, yeah. I, I can't remember what it's called, but I bought it in quite a big pot. One of them size pots, about what eight inches across, and it gets smaller and smaller every year. So I don't think it likes it there. I might have to move it. But look at your daisies. I think we're going to have to split them at the end of the season. They've gone wild. Yeah, I do like the daisies. Yeah. Especially when they flower, they look nothing now. Well, look at all the birds. Yeah, when they flower, they're they are pretty. Yeah. And the rose is coming on. That was that was a little was that one that Stacey sent or was it just a spot that was in the garden? No, no, that was one of the ones that Stacey sent. Yeah. One of them basket um, arrangements. Yeah, because some of it was in a basket uh, with a lot of other floral arrangements. Yeah. That's done all right. It has done all right. <laughs> yeah, I missed yep. one there. That, oh, that trip yeah. over there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bamboo. And Oh, I'm so chuffed. Can you get in here? Probably. Look at my arum lilies. They have come back after being split and put in the garden because they were in a pot. Excellent. I wasn't sure they'd come back, so I put half in a pot and half in the garden. But yes. Salvia. White salvia. I couldn't remember what that was last time we walked around. And I've been trying to force it into my head. Salvia. <laughs> Bigger Savlon. Savlon, yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm in line Phoebe's doing my look. That's in flower now. Yeah, pretty. Lovely flowers on that. Yeah. And look. Ooh, peaches. Peaches. <laughs> yeah. A couple more in there. Mm. One there. Yeah, one in there, yeah. yeah. I did find seven. That doesn't mean we'll get seven because the birds always get to them before we do, don't they? They do. Yeah. I'm so chuffed with these because <laughs> they're from last year. The geraniums, yeah. They've, they've, no. they've come back with a vengeance, they've yeah. Really come but back. we didn't have much of a wind to well, much of a frost anyway. Not really, no. So I mean, we did have some frost, so we did, they should but have died. It wasn't really, really heavy. No. That's looking quite full now as well. Yeah. Well, I mean, I had to move it. Mm. It was over there underneath the um, mm -hmm. fabulous 
and, uh, so. and the bamboo. I mean, bamboo that just, that's just that's just amazing. Yeah. <laughs> but we've got a bit of a change in this corner, haven't we? We have. There's no buds on this oleander like there is on the other one, look. Mm. I did cut that back quite hard at the end of the season. Yes, so I had you struggling, didn't I? Yes, previous video. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and I got attacked by this vicious thing, <laughs> the monkey puzzle. Yeah. yeah. Lethal yeah. they are, very spiky and very sharp. Yeah. Oh, you were in there, you could have pulled that weed underneath it. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, so we've now used the leftover sleeper that we had. We kept wondering what to do with it, didn't we? Yeah, just the kind of raised border, really, on a couple of bricks. Well, you can see the bricks on there. Yeah. yeah. It just adds a bit of height and a bit of and interest. And we can see them when we're sitting on the seats over there now, can't we? Yeah. I've brought this over here to see how it does. This is a Chinese lumbago, but I've got one in that corner and I've got one in this corner. Yeah. And I think I and whatever was there hasn't come back, so I'll put that there to see how it goes. But yeah. Yeah, and believe it or not, we did sweep this back end <laughs> since the last video, but look at it. That's literally a that couple of days. Well. Yeah, a couple yeah. of days mess that is. It's, oh God, it's just a, an endless task. I used to come out here and sweep it every morning, but I got fed up with that. <laughs> oh, something. This isn't happy. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to have to come out of the and get those dead bits off, I think. Yeah. Look there as well. Yeah, that's watered quite badly, or whatever's happened to it. Yeah. I wonder if it needs a good soak, because it does, look how dry the soil yeah. is here. Yeah. I'm going to get the sprinkle on. Look at all the buds on that rose bush. Yeah, that's doing really well. And of course the olive tree just keeps coming back better and better. I've given that a really good hack this time. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to make the joke. No, I don't. I think we've done that in a... <laughs> yeah, I think yeah, so. And well, you can show my grass because I'm quite proud of my grass well, after I'm, all of the... I'm just scanning up to the eucalyptus as well, which is, it's followed the sun, which mm. is a slight bit annoying, but we have one, a previous house, and it did exactly the same. It follows the sun, so you can see the, the actual bark and the, the trunk is gone and followed it. But that, that's doing well. I think the last one we had in Northborough, as it was, uh, it grew to about 30 foot. It was just a yeah. horrendous. But well, that's quite up in the tree, look. It is. Yeah, it's gone right up there. But uh, yes, I will now scan around to the grass. Yeah, um, I've worked hard on the grass, haven't I? You've done a lot with it, definitely. And it's beginning to come round now. Mm. There's a few spots. There's one here. But yeah. So I don't think we need to whip it up now. I'm quite happy. No, it's looking quite lush. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I'm okay with some different colours in it and everything else. It's never going to be perfect, but yeah, it's it's a lot better than when we moved in. Oh, gosh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was a mess. You to, it a picture there. Oh, I did do last time, if you remember. Time yeah, but maybe I'll find some more pictures. Who knows? We might add them in at this point here. Maybe. Prompting me in edit. <laughs> and that is. <laughs> Sisters. Yeah, it's a sister. It's a sister. And it looks as though that needs some water as well. Mm. Everything was fed yesterday. So. Oh, what about my little findling look? <laughs> what have we got? Let me squeeze in. <laughs> little hosta all little on its own. I found coming up. <laughs> yeah. And that conifer is, well, that kind of wants moving because it's just tucked behind there. Let me, I let know, me scan in. But we haven't got anywhere to put it, have we? So mm. it's a shame because yeah. it's a, one of them lemon cycles. Clematis is out this yes, time, yeah, the did white get, one. Did get that, yeah, oh, Clematis, that, yeah, yeah, in there. Okay. And then this holster and this holster are doing well. But look at all that eucalyptus, they're all... Yeah, just to show you a bit hidden, but um, yeah, especially that holster back there. Yeah, poor thing. And look yeah. at the stripes on the leaf, it's lovely. Yeah, yeah, but, um, yeah my... Um, yeah, that. Pittosporum. Pittosporum, that's the one. Yeah. My Pittosporum's taken over the garden and yeah. the uh, the maple has just gone, well, yeah. it's just a well, crazy I've again. I've got all under here and I've had to call the lower branches off so that we could see these things from over there. Mm -hmm. He's looking for mushrooms because uh -huh. there's been mushrooms growing in the garden. Get your nose out. But we think they're toasties, mm, don't they? Not going to do you any yeah. good, whatever they are. Look at that poster. Yes. Underneath the Acer. Yeah, Isn't that Acer beautiful? And this area is filling out quite nicely and got some colour this time you know, of year. I actually think this side this year is better than that side. It's definitely got some nice colour and that, that yeah. oh, 
I assume it's a conifer. That's yeah. got some beautiful colours in it. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, we've yeah, got reds yeah. and greens and pinks and all sorts, all sorts of stuff going yeah. on there. This I've put in this morning, mm -hmm. and that's a Veronica. It's a pink Veronica. Okay. I had a dahlia there and in there last year, but they rotted. Mm. So I do need to get something new to put in there. Um, whatever this is, I'm sure you'll tell me, is amazing. That's a dianthus. Okay. Pinks, we used to call them. Yeah, we I was going to say pinks. Yeah. But, um, yeah. And the candy stripe blocks is packed at the finish now. Yeah. Look at all the flowers. Yeah. I, I do love my pinkers, because they come in all different colours. Yeah, that area's definitely gone then. Um, that's quite a bronzy one, isn't it? That's only got one flower. It's <laughs> probably dwarfed by the astilbe. I was going to say, it's gone crazy, but it hasn't. It's just filled out. It's just filled out, mm. yeah. yeah. That's nice. Look at the Rigela now, it's all in flower. Although it's just about to go over. Mm -hmm. The pink at the back. Yeah. That's, that's beautiful. Yeah. And, you... and I've got, I've been trying to remember the name, Agapanthus bulbs I threw in just there. Mm -hmm. And they have come. I don't think they'll do anything this year. And your balls have had a trim? Yes, yeah, everything's had a trim. You didn't notice. <laughs> Another addition today. Yeah, I bought a couple of more, couple more dahlias. Because mm. I just thought it would give a bit of colour by these. Because I'm not convinced that the tomatoes will flower this year. So yeah, I went off to look at some cars. Uh, the cars and coffee. <laughs> And uh, I got a message saying I've been to the garden centre and I couldn't find what I wanted so I bought everything else. I went for liquid seaweed, mm. that's what I went for, but they didn't have any. So, so, so you bought the shop out so instead? I plants, as you do. <laughs> as you do, yeah. Now these were lilies, just in a plastic pot that I was given for my birthday in December, but they are coming back. I hope to find somewhere to pop them really. This geranium is from last year. <laughs> it's got a viola in it. Okay. Me. <laughs> yeah. Now this I've just had to spray because it's covered in little white bugs. I'm scanning and see if I can find some. Just there, look on that leaf, but they're not moving now, so I'm hoping that my washing up liquid will have sorted them out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Lemon one. And that clematis is doing good. That is amazing, isn't it? Mm. And so is my black lace. Look at that, because I chopped it down to the ground, didn't I? Look at the flowers. Yeah. But it's doing that now. Doing what? It's doing, doing that. that. Doing that? Yeah. Oh, so okay. I think I'm going to have to <laughs> chop it at each side to push it. Yeah. Push it. Okay. But yeah, this is a double clematis. Mm. Really pretty. The tree's looking better after its little chop. Oh yes, it's like a tree, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Again, these geraniums were last year's. And these, not that, this was last year's as well, so that's coming back. That's a bit of um dipsophilia. <sighs> uh -huh -huh. Calla lilies. So they're coming through now. Every mm -hmm. time I look, I see more shoots coming through. There is, this has had a haircut as well, but it's already growing. Look at all the new bits. <laughs> Didn't take long. But everything's looking really, really colourful now. I'm, mm. I'm thrilled with the garden this year. I really am. And we've got the pot over here, which, uh, again, very colourful, but still got some growing to do by the looks of it. Yeah, again, these were from last year, so they're beginning to go now. Mm. Yeah, all I added was the bellies. And then we scan up. Oh yeah. What about that? And that's really beginning to go now. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, that's looking good. It is. Well, if we quickly, if we quickly go this away, mm. we'll go over to the other side one. You're not looking at these then? Oh. <laughs> You've looked at all those. Have you? I only yeah. talked about that one. Oh, okay. Yeah, right. Look at the dahlias. So they've all been pinched now. So all they've got to do now is grow. So you've been stealing? <laughs> <laughs> not that sort of pinch. Oh, no. okay. No. Not, not been pinched, not stolen. They've been pinched, pinched, pinched. They've pinched. been pinched, 
Yeah, I've yeah. got to say the uh, the bungee straps around the pot really does add to it. Yeah, uh, I look, think they can probably come off. There's now, a little story they? behind that. Um, this being very top heavy, blew over several times in the winds recently. So we had to um, take drastic measures on the day, which include lots of bungee straps. It was either that or it's going to be gaffer tape. So yeah, I'm going to have to do something with this. Yeah, that's going rather top heavy. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. I think it perhaps needs a stronger stake. And these, yeah. they're, they're little. My lilac has had a real, I mean, crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which I perhaps shouldn't have done. But and they're lilies as well, aren't they? Aren't they? Yeah, I think these are the. Um, what is it that one? I can't remember which pot it is at the moment. But one of them is calla lilies and one of them is the arum lily, the other half of the one that's coming back up over there. Yeah. Really? But yeah, these as well, they've all been pinched, so they're quite happy. And <laughs> look at the fig tree now I've moved it, it's really going for it. So that's some figs for Christmas then? <laughs> no, I do. Yeah. <laughs> Unlikely. Unlikely, yeah. And then, that, we go this way a bit, yeah. and we have... I think this one's better than the other one. Look at that. Yeah, because in a few weeks ago they were just little yeah. sprogs in there. Uh, yep, yeah. doing all right. It's doing all right. Doing all right. Now then. Yes, this area here. Look at that. We've got an impressive, um, I'm not going to say erection, <laughs> <laughs> an, an impressive growth, which probably isn't much better. <laughs> yes. Yeah, if I put my hand there, you can see how big it is. Mm. Right up to my elbow, it is huge and it's the most beautiful coral colour mm. so I'm, I really want to take some seeds from that this yeah year. definitely yeah it's beautiful and then these were up here so I just put the scissors in each and look at them coming back so I'm going to do the same this side because they're getting a bit leggy and this that's really come back I know it's only half that's, of what it used yeah, to be yeah yeah it is but I'm hoping that something will happen in it it'll spread out yeah and for the first time for a few years that's flowering mm. it's like hebe isn't it yeah yeah my mint for my mojitos <laughs> yeah mm. and a little boy that's been with us for years <laughs> oh it was my dad's wasn't it mm. yeah. yeah so that's the garden really mm. yeah so i'm over the moon with the garden this year yeah, it is. Yeah. It's come back very well. It's been pretty. Yeah. It's been a lot of work. But you know, if you scan that side and then scan that side, I actually think that the waterlogged side is prettier than the sunny side this year. Well, let's see. Oh, I guess really it's up to the, the subscribers to uh, decide. Yeah. Stick it in the comments. Which is the better yeah. side? Give me a comment. We'll call that side, as we're looking at the back of the garden, we'll call it the right hand side. The sunny side. Alright, the sunny side. Yeah. Or, or the acer side. How about that? Well, let, let's call this the boggy side. The boggy side. Because yeah, it's always full it of water. So that's the yeah, boggy side near the shed. There you go. And that one is the sunny side. <laughs> Against, uh, against, oh, I could say both got fences, but yeah, that's the sunny side. You yeah. choose which is the best one. Yeah. Okay, thank you for joining us in the garden this week, this month. We don't do it every week, do we? Leave me a thumbs up, please subscribe. See you next time. Bye. Yeah, we've fun, Ted. Yeah, we've fun. Fresh I am. <laughs>